In the flame test lab, we will use a hot flame to excite the electrons around metal ions to generate different colors of flame. We will do this for eight known nitrate salts, and then we will test two unknown chloride salts to see if we can identify what those salts are. If you look at the well plate here, you'll see in the top row, from left to right, we have barium nitrate, calcium nitrate, copper two nitrate, and iron three nitrate. In the middle row, from left to right, we have lithium nitrate, potassium nitrate, sodium nitrate, and strontium nitrate. And at the bottom, in the lower left, we have unknown A, and next to that, in the lower row on the right, we have unknown B. We will use wooden splints soaked in water. They're soaked in water so that we can pick up the salt and put it in the flame without the splint catching on fire. Once we have finished testing the color of the salt, we will place it in the waste beaker to the left. So we'll turn off the light here. And the first salt we will test is barium. The next salt we'll test is calcium, calcium nitrate. The next salt we'll test is copper 2 nitrate. The next salt we'll test is iron 3 nitrate. The next salt we'll test is lithium nitrate. The next salt is potassium nitrate.
and then sodium nitrate. Looks like we've contaminated our Bunsen burner there. There we go. And finally, strontium nitrate. So those were our known salts. Those were all nitrate salts. Now we have two chloride salts. Now each of these chloride salts has a metal ion from one of our eight known nitrate salts. So while the metals may be the same, the chloride ion connected to it is not, so there may be a slight difference. However, based on the color of each unknown, you should be able to identify it. Here's unknown A. Remember this is the chloride salt unknown A. So that was unknown A. And finally, unknown B. So based on their colors, 